Good morning everybody, it's Deanna with ToolsOfEnergyProtection.com, your energy shift expert, where I help you to navigate all the energies to create your most wonderful desired outcome. <laughs> How's everybody doing today? It's Saturday, it's an absolutely beautiful day, and it is April the 1st, April Fool's Day. <laughs> I think that has something to do with the calendars and the way that they shifted things around between the way the calendars used to be run and the uh, Roman calendar which we currently um, live under. So uh, I know it's a little bit early this morning, uh, 9 o'clock on a Saturday and I'm usually not up on this time on the weekends. <laughs> But the boss said that we needed to do one, so let's get busy and talk about what's happening. We're also going to have one tomorrow, I believe, at 10 a.m. If you go to uh, toolsofenergyprotection.com and uh, look on the um, toolbar, you can get the Swift Energy Shift, and it'll give you the next times, or in the feed here if you're on Facebook, uh, the time for tomorrow, and I believe it's 10 o'clock. Anyway, what's going on, everybody? Um, What's going on is, okay, uh, anyways, what's, <laughs> shiny, uh, what's going on is uh, the next couple of days are going to be lovely, the energy is still uplifting us, we talked about that last time where um, the energy is uplifting us to lead a happier, healthier life and everything that we've planned on in the past or up until now, um, it's being supported the last couple of days. And today is absolutely no different. It's beautiful. Uh, it's a gorgeous day, even though here where I'm at in uh, Loveland, Colorado, it's a little bit cloudy outside. Um, the uh, the temperature is a little bit cool, as you can see, um, but still pretty, pretty, pretty nice. So what's going on? This is a time to reset your inner compass. Uh, yesterday, uh, I looked at a lot of the energies and things just were, they were feeling good and I was feeling uplifted, but I was feeling like I wasn't headed uh, totally in the right direction. So it's like I needed to <laughs> shift myself to a different angle. So the inner compass is what guides us with God, Spirit, or Source. The inner compass is what um, helps us to know whether we're doing the right thing or not the right thing. And right now with the way the energy frequencies are with the planets, the, there's a shift between the focus being um, in our spirit minds and bodies to our physical minds and bodies. So this is a huge time of creation, an absolute huge time. So whatever you've been thinking about, whatever's been in your head and you haven't been doing, it's time to get it done and to bring it down into the 3D world. And this has a lot to do with prosperity, has a lot to do with abundance, has a lot to do with um, your divine aspect and uh, bringing that to the physical and blessing other people's lives with it, no matter what you do, whether you're retired or whether you work full time or you know, you're an admin or a CEO of a company, it doesn't really matter. Time to take action. And through that action that you do for yourself, other people will discover themselves. They'll see what you're doing and they go, wow, you know, look what Bob's doing and isn't that great? And it will um, inspire him to move on. So uh, good morning uh, again, Deanna. <laughs> you're very lovely to join this morning. And um, uh, it, again, it's a beautiful day. So compass, your inner compass, let's talk a little bit about that. So your inner compass is, again, your navigation between you, uh, spirit or source, um, uh, it's about um, how you bring that divine energy into the physical, and that's the shift. So you may be feeling a little off because some of us will uh, guide ourselves by listening to spirit or guidance and walk in that direction, and some of us are more bullheaded, and we just keep going and we keep driving in the direction we feel that things need to go. So the next couple of days, those two things are combining. They're reaching out, they're shaking hands with each other, and becoming more uh, at one uh, for the rest of this year. So that's the shift you're feeling. Um, also, your electromagnetic frequency, uh, that which uh, surrounds your body and your torus, um, is also shifting because of that. And then in addition to the electromagnetic, some people are feeling the biomagnetic frequency. So uh, biomagnetic is just a subset of electromagnetism and it has to do more with your physical body. So that's what's happening everybody. The shift is going on uh, between those two. And uh, tomorrow again I'll come on and we'll talk a little bit more about 
uh, these things that are happening. But in the meantime, um, what we're going to do is ask for God's Spirit or Source to work with each and every one of your uh, guides and angels and to bring that divine loving energy in through the top of your head all the way down through the bottom of your feet and then bringing it back up around to the top of your head again and circling it so that you're more aware uh, that your spiritual and your physical body are one. So have a great and wonderful day, everybody. It's a little bit cold, <laughs> and I decided to come outside because it is a lovely weekend. It's actually peaceful. If you go outside and you listen very intently, it's just a, a very peaceful day. Even if you're in downtown uh, New York or if you're in Manhattan, go listen. It's a beautiful day. Anyways, I will see you here tomorrow. Again, I said I think about 10 o'clock. If not, go to toolsofenergyprotection.com, click on events and uh, the swift energy shift and the time will be there. Have a great and wonderful day.